morning. <clears throat> I'm out here in Big Pine Key. Um, we got an Airbnb last night. It's just a uh, fifth wheel in a RV park. It's actually pretty nice. Uh, it's fine for me and my family. We don't we don't need a big mansion or anything. It's uh, 7:29 a.m. We have a rental boat down there. It's a 21 foot, 22 foot rather, uh, twin V with a 140 Suzuki four stroke on it. The motor looks to be brand new, which is nice because it's probably going to be reliable. Um, the wind today is supposed to be down pretty low, pretty small winds. So we uh, we might have a shot to run offshore and do some fishing out there. But first and foremost, number one for me is I have to get a big tarpon. Uh, I struck out in Grand Cayman, and uh, I I've, I mean almost had sleepless nights about it. It's uh, it's something that needs to be done for me. I I need that photo of me in the water with that big silver king. Uh, we saw some big fish at Robbie's at Isla Morada yesterday, and. Uh, you know that kind of fueled the fire even more and kind of cemented it even further that that's what needs to happen so me being who I am I uh, I'm always doing a million things at once and I left some of our gear at the Airbnb so the guys Kenny and Joe are getting the boat ready and I ran back to get gear um, so I figured I'd shoot a, shoot this first video and, and get it going for the morning um, yeah, tarpon. I, I, I can't say anything else. Tarpon. Let's go get tarpon. We just got here and it looks like things are gonna be good. They're they're busting everywhere. I'm talking about busting. I'm gonna let this roll for a second because it's gonna happen. Busted. They are active right now. Bahia Honda Tarpon. Uh, we're doing this for real. We are on our eighth hookup so far. Joe up here battling this monstrous fish.
right below us. He's headed that way. <laughs> yes. He's turning again. He's turning right. pretty much a wrap for me on Bahia Honda Tarpon. Uh, I just came back off the water. We had a great morning, multiple hookups. Didn't didn't um, get our hands on any fish, but we did get the leaders to the boat. And uh, the last one I had was huge. It was for sure over 150. I don't know beyond that how big it was, but I will say it's, it was over 150. Um, and my hook broke, we fought it forever got it out away from the bridge, the pilings, the cement, the metal, all that, and the hook broke. What do you do? Uh, I'm, I'm super glad I came to do this. Now I know the fishery if I ever want to come back, and uh, I likely will. Um, it's important for me to get in the water and get a picture with one of these fish, but whatever. I have zero complaints. I'm super happy. I'm glad I did this. Uh... Coming up next is Spring Chinook. Um, I'll be flying out this evening, excuse me, tomorrow evening out of Fort Lauderdale to go back to Washington and start in on some springers. Um, really fun time of year up there. So stay tuned for that footage and uh, over and out. Cascade TV, here we go.